good evening. Recently, we have faced a tomato shortage due to the hurricanes, which not only affected life and property, tomatoes were ruined. Thus, tomatoes became in short supply, prices skyrocketed. Tomato lovers were dismayed because we had to pay more for tomatoes. This was disappointing because tomatoes are a very versatile plant. Technically, tomatoes are considered a fruit, but are more like vegetables in property and uses. Tomatoes can be used for side dishes or main dishes. They can be used in salads or sandwiches. Tomatoes can be chopped, cut, diced, mashed, blended, juiced, you name it. Tomatoes have tons of uses. In fact, tomatoes might even be the most versatile. George Washington Carver found 100 uses for peanuts. I think tomatoes have peanuts and beef. Soy is also versatile. I think perhaps tomatoes have soy beef. Probably the only other vegetable that competes with tomatoes would be potato. In addition to all these uses of tomatoes, tomatoes are used as ingredients in a number of products. There are tons of tomato-based products. You have ketchup, salsa, spaghetti, pizza, tomato soup, tomato juice. The name just a few. I was afraid tomato-based products would go up in prices since tomatoes themselves were. But this did not happen, fortunately. Perhaps the tomato companies had stored these tomato based products that already were in reserves therefore there was enough supply well, fresh tomatoes dwindled in supply processed tomato products were steady perhaps the reason prices rose was because of the economic law of supply and demand. When there's low demand, or low supply, prices go up. When there's high demand, or high supply, prices go down. Typically, tomatoes are not the most expensive food. They're almost a dime a dozen. They're cheaper food, but there's a lot of food which is more expensive.
when a shortage occurred, tomatoes were scarce. We all know scarcity is value. They became a prized commodity. My dad was saying when he owned a restaurant, a crate of tomatoes would cost twelve dollars. He says now the same tomatoes would cost sixty six. My stepmom was saying restaurants which usually give tomatoes on sandwiches without thought were asking people because restaurants did not want to waste tomatoes. Tomatoes were that much. Money. She also said she heard they were slicing tomatoes more thinly. Isn't it interesting how such an event changes our perception of tomatoes? In some ways, it can be beneficial. Although I love tomatoes, I do see advantages that come from the shortage. When I went to visit my dad, I was going to have a veggie burger. Typically, I have a tomato on the sandwich. Unfortunately, there was no tomatoes. At his house, my dad said they were too expensive because of the shortage. Later, when I went shopping, I grabbed some Roma tomatoes since they weren't quite as expensive even though those have went up too. He said they don't have any taste. I don't think Roma tomatoes are as good as the other type, but to me they're definitely preferable to nothing. Since my dad did not have tomatoes when I had the, those first veggie burgers, he recommended having onions and mushrooms. I was hesitant of the idea at first. Later, I decided I would go for it. I ended up having mushrooms on the burger. I didn't even have a bun. It still was really good. I wouldn't have tried that if there was not the tomato shortage. There can be a vicious cycle. Tomatoes are in short supply and therefore prices rise. People don't like that, thus people don't want to buy tomatoes. Therefore prices have to rise even more. One of the reasons prices rise is because the tomato companies want to make the same profit. They have bills to pay. They want to put food on their tables, too. If few people are buying tomatoes, they need to charge more per unit in order to make the same level of profit. I wonder why couldn't this have happened to any other vegetable? Why? The delicious, nutritious, versatile, useful tomato. Why not some other one? Tomatoes one I just couldn't do it out. Perhaps if it did happen to another vegetable, another plant, another food, we may not notice because it would not be valued the way tomatoes would. Maybe there's a shortage of another vegetable such as broccoli right now. Boom. We don't notice because we don't care. When I went to the co-op one day, I was walking in the bulk food section. In the bulk food section was vanilla. There was a sign by vanilla apologizing for the high prices. It said there was a very bad season for vanilla. 